And welcome back. And on this edition, we are gonna have some Inferno Candy Company goodies. I'm all for them, so. <laughs> no, they're, they're delicious. Some of them I purchased, some of them they were nice enough to send to us. Every time, there's, ne there's never a disappointment. No, that's <laughs> true. I think, I think just about everything we've gotten from them so far has been good. And these are the Cracklins. So these are essentially the pork cracklin, uh, the pig snacks. Sean, hold on. I know you like pork rinds. Yep. Yep, she actually put me onto them. So. Oh, look at that. And they're just good to dip in cheese. Hmm, interesting. No oh, shit. I know Katie from Beyond Seattle Eats tried these and she loved them. Oh, good. It has like a smoky barbecue kind of taste. And my taste buds screwed up. <laughs> I'm not getting the barbecue, but... <laughs> She's got to shake them a little bit. She needs to get some seasoning on there. It's got a nice, it's got a nice little low, comfortable heat. It is. Maybe I'm just crazy. We're just, I'm going crazy. <laughs> they get oh, like a special hot cheese with it. It'd be good. I feel like maybe I pulled pork on it or something. Mm -hmm. Pork rind. Pork rind. Yeah, I can see demolishing a whole bag of these things. <laughs> it's wow. It's keto approved, so. Okay, I had a really coated one. That one's in the back of my throat nicely. One thing about Inferno, I know that they, they definitely don't skimp on the heat when it comes to their products. I learned that the hard way with the um, Hell Puffs Challenge. <laughs> oh, there we go. After you eat so many, there you go. Hi! <laughs> just to eat so many just to get some kind of heat out of it, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, you have to eat like five or six of these. There you go. This is the true pe creeper. Do the creep. and do the creep. That might be, but they sure do taste damn good though. Mm -hmm. Cherry bomb! <laughs> All right, we got some cherry bombs, and these are the dark chocolate variety. The thing I like about these, though, they're individually wrapped. Oh, that one got a little, okay. a little melty. That's okay. These have been in the fridge. All right, here we go. Whoa. Definitely dark chocolate. Hmm? Dark chocolate. Mm hmm. Mm. Once you rip open that cherry, it's like, hey, it splashes all those ingredients there. Yep. <sighs> And unlike the um, the cracklings, though, the heat is pretty. It's straightforward. It's pretty immediate. <laughs> huh. Well, let's just do uh, like a chocolate bar of theirs and just melt it and just do strawberries. I'm not much of a cherry person, but. <laughs> yeah. No, it's, it's it's coming back here. It's setting up the jamboree. <laughs> yeah, that's, it's got some good heat, good flavor. Mm -hmm. Again, I think they have them in dark chocolate and milk chocolate, but I just opted for the dark chocolate. Mm -hmm. So I think what I did was I got the pretzels, mm -hmm. and I ended up getting those in the milk chocolate. Okay. And those were great. <laughs> I, I killed those. This actually arrived in the mail today. This is their firecracker peanut butter cheese crackers. Oh. Insanely hot. Oh, these. God damn. Okay. They come in this little pack here. Oh shit, do I have scissors? I'm just curious if he put anything in the peanut butter. That's probably, I mean, that's the thing. I, I don't know if he like. I don't know if it just coated on the cracker or. I don't know. Oh, it's a hot mess. All right, we're going in. All hands, race for impact! I can smell the peanut butter right away though, that's a good sign. I want jelly. <laughs> oh, that smells good. Do I like peanut butter? Yep. Cheese is kind of hidden. 
I just taste peanut butter. I got peanut butter, but I taste heat too. Mm. You left it all on the cracker spice. I'm curious. Mm. It's a regular cracker. And then you can just put the um. Yeah, seasoning on it. Mm -hmm. I'm checking. No, this is like after school snack time right now, only with heat. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't be surprised if that looked like the same cheese uh, dustings and stuff that they put on like the Hell Puffs. But granted, these aren't like the challenge. I don't think these are the challenge edition heat. The slaughter powder. Mm -hmm. Not cheese. Yep, yeah, that's on the bottom of mine. Hmm? I like these over the cherries. Yeah, I can I can snack on these. The, these and the um, the cracklins. These and the cracklins, I can snack on these, and I probably will. You will be. You will be. All right, we got. Is that Arana? Arena? Al increíble hombre araña. It's a peanut butter and Carolina Reaper infused fudge brownie. So more peanut butter. <laughs> and I know they have another one called the Black Widow, if I'm not mistaken. All right. Oh, look at that. Oh, geez. Yep. Is, is it a little, a little hard? Yeah. Uh -oh. Uh. oh well. Nope. Nope. <laughs> I crushed it. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh boy. All right. Get the cheese out of my. I think I can smell the reaper in there. All right. Mmm. Sorry, it's just dry. <laughs> It is dry, but it's still very tasty. My tolerance is like, nope, hi. <laughs> Welcome. I like the peanut butter, though. I do like the chocolate flavor on it. I'm not really getting the peanut butter out of it, honestly. There's there very little. I went after that part. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair. Uh, to be fair. To be fair. Oh, to be fair. I think I've had this a little while. <laughs> I mean, they ship really fast too, though. They get stuff to you really quick. Yeah. All right, there's some of the peanut butter. <laughs> Those are some offerings from Inferno Candy Company. Be sure to go check them out. I'm going to put a link in the description. Thank you guys for sending out the uh, the brownie and the um, the peanut butter crackers. Mm -hmm. Those were good. For me, I think the crackers and the crack ones were the standouts. Yeah. I would definitely um definitely get those again. And then if you're looking for a legit heat challenge. Their Hell Puffs Challenge Edition is definitely worth going for because uh, that shit's hot. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for tuning in. Like this video, put notes in the comments there if you've tried some of their products, um, recommend something, and uh, we'll see you next time.